Venezuela tonight. Opposition leader Juan Guaido calling for more protests this weekend as he and his supporters continue their push to oust President Nicolas Maduro. At least five have been killed during a violent week of demonstrations. And here in South Florida, a show of solidarity for the Venezuelan opposition movement. Music producer Emilio Estefan and others hosting a prayer vigil tonight in Miami. And that's where we find Local 10's Christian De La Rosa live tonight. Christian. Well, you see the crew behind me breaking down the stage that was supposed to hold this event. The weather didn't cooperate, but that didn't matter. Nothing can, can detain the spirit of the Venezuelan people. Rain could not stop Miami from coming together for Venezuela. To send a message for Miami, I mean, with a hope. Hope for Venezuela, we know it's going to be free. Emilio Estefan and the city of Miami setting the stage for an historic show of support. I think this is a critical moment. Friday evening showers, seeing the crowd indoors at Estefan Kitchen in the Miami Design District. Prayer, a moment of silence, and a rally to the tune of the Miami Symphony Orchestra. As the face-off continues between demonstrators opposing Nicolás Maduro and troops loyal to the country's socialist leader, at least four people have reportedly been killed and hundreds more injured. It's hard for me to just sit there and not be a part of this. Venezuelans here tonight say they remain hopeful. I feel like the end is near. Hoping, praying, and some demanding action. How many lives is it going to take for the world to step in and help the Venezuelan people? And that's a good question. The hope tonight here is that all those prayers and those good vibes help change some hearts. The mayor of Miami, Francis Suarez, telling me he is monitoring the crisis as something that directly impacts Miami. And we're live in Miami tonight. I'm Christian De La Rosa, Local 10 News. A powerful message.